is the first big trend. And the second big trend, which William has actually already mentioned, is, um, I'll try to think of a catchy way of saying it, but I think the, the phrase I would use is it must be mobile. We have to assume, going forward, that the way people access the internet will be on a mobile device. And that could be um, in their home using Wi-Fi, it could be on the move, um, inside their offices, <coughs> on the bus, on the train, wherever. But uh, I think one of the figures in your report is 44% of people now have smartphones. Um, now, when we have this, um, this um, speed revolution, one of the things that will be a very, very important part of that is um, high-speed mobile broadband. So that, for example, um, as happens in Korea, people are able to watch TV um, when they need to work on the bus or the train. And uh, at the moment, mobile data is tripling every year in the UK. So that by the end of this parliament, it will be about 26 times the level that it currently is. Um, and that is going to provide a huge headache for people like me responsible for our digital infrastructure. <coughs> we have big plans in place. Um, but um, maybe this is a dangerous thing to say, but if you're in the cultural sector, I think you should assume the government's going to be successful in this. Um, and we are going to deliver on our broadband infrastructure. And that then provides you the kind of opportunities um, to really uh, develop the most innovative, exciting, interesting uh, fundraising um, techniques. Um, so um, that's all I would say, except that um, if that all sounds uh, too uh, hairy and scary, um, uh, you should remember a quote that Ronald Reagan said when he was going through a difficult patch. He said, things are going so sticky, I'm beginning to have sleepless afternoons. Um, don't let this give you any sleep this afternoon, um, but I hope you think it's a great opportunity. Thank you very much.